Okay, so I've left my shower, so it gets lots of soap scum. It's dirty, as you can see, those glass doors. And I find they're a horrible thing to clean. Glass, this is my shower. It's glass, top to bottom. I had the scrubbing bobbles thing up there. I don't like it, it's all chemicals. You press the button, it spins around, and it cleans it, but not like I would like it. I've tried all natural mixtures like vinegars, and sometimes those vinegars can get very strong. I've tried bleaches. I've tried probably all the cleaners on the market to try to find something that I'd be good with. I've used essential oils for years, but I've never thought of using essential oils for a bathtub surround. So I'm gonna try the Thieves Essential Oil. It's by Young Living. I've started buying essential oils and I'm actually gonna start selling it also. I swear by essential oils for your everyday living. It's healthy. So I'm gonna make up a mixture and put it on these glass shower walls and we'll see how it cleans. Like I, I don't really like chemicals, but I will definitely use them if they give me good results, but nothing's really gave me the results I've been looking for. So the thieves and the lemon oil, they're all natural. I'm just gonna put in some hot water and we'll see what we got. I got myself a great big bowl. I'm gonna turn on the hot water. My hot water's not super hot here because I have grandchildren that come in and turn the hot water on super hot. And I don't want them to get scalded, so we turned it down in the basement. So my super hot is bearable. I don't know if this bowl is gonna go under here. I'm just gonna wait to get our hottest temperature. So it's a nice big mixing bowl. And then I'm going to take the lemon essential oil. I'm sorry, I have to do it this way, my videos. I don't have a tripod right now, but I've ordered one. So soon you'll be able to watch every step. So this is uh, essential oils by Young Living Lemon. And we'll add, let's say, one, two, three, four. That came out quick. Five, six, seven. That's probably about eight drops of lemon in there. It was hard to count the drops because it just started pouring out. But I would say around eight. The next one is the Thieves. They have their own blend and it's called Thieves. This one's the essential oil, not the cleaner. I've been doing videos of the cleaner and the Thieves would be in the cleaner, but this one's the pure essential oil. I'm having to open it with one hand. So I'm gonna have to stop for a second. So the Thieves, essential oil, it smells cinnamony. So I'm gonna do, ah, none, no, one, two, three, four, five, let's see. Six, we'll say six drops. We did six and eight. We'll say it was like five to six. It was definitely six. So we'll say six to eight. And we're gonna stir it around. Stir it to mix it. I can smell the lemon and the thieves. It smells good. We're gonna bring that over to the shower. We're gonna get in the shower. I'm gonna take off my socks. I hate getting my feet wet in the shower. And I'm gonna do some 
Grimy walls. Okay, so now you can see I'm in the shower. This is the grimy front door. You can just see it. I have my paper towel. I'm gonna dip it in the thieves. And lemon oil and hot water. And I'm gonna wipe the grime and see what it looks like. I have to hold the door a bit. I'm going to take the other side and dry it a bit to see. And you know what, surprisingly, the grime and soap scum is wiping all off. This is the worst part at the bottom. I don't know if I'm getting this on video, not really. But it is all wiping off. I have to hold the door because it'll go both ways. So you saw how I wiped. I'm going to get a, another paper towel and dry it. So this is where I wiped. This is where it isn't done. So we'll see what the difference is. Here I am drying it. And really it's cleaner. It's kind of amazing. Simply amazing. So I just thought this up right now. So I've got a spray bottle. I'm going to immerse it in the mixture of the thieves oil and the lemon. I'm going to spray one glass surround. And I'm going to spray two, I guess. One of them I'm just going to rinse later on and the other I'm gonna wipe off and see if you have to wipe it or if you just have to rinse it, then we know. And we'll see how clean the two of them work. So I'm gonna spray this straight to the top. I have no fear of this stuff. It's just oils and water. I don't have to hold my breath. I don't have to feel sick later. I don't have to stink or the house stinks. So we'll spray this whole one. I'm going to spray the other panel too. I have to get it wet enough. And then I'm going to leave it. We're going to come back. I'm going to rinse one with water and the other I'm going to wipe. And we'll see what they do. Look at how the soap scum. So this one, where it meets has lots and this has more, I'm going to check it in about 15 20 minutes. I'm going to get more in the bottle and start spraying all the slate. That spray is not really good. It's very narrow. As you can see, there's lots of buildup on the slate. So I'm going to spray it and leave it too, and we'll see what it does. Remember, this shower has been left just for this video. It's dirty, that's for sure. I need to spray the crow. It smells wonderful, it smells like Christmas in here. Okay, okay so we've waited about approximately 15 minutes. And I've got a towel, and we're going to try that edge that has a lot of soap scum on it. And we're going to see, and it's hard for you to see here because I have the outside tube of the glass that isn't clear, but the soap scum is coming right off. So remember, we were going to wipe that one it's gone and then we're gonna splash this one with water and see how it looks when it's done because maybe you don't have to wipe it maybe you just splash it and it's done spray splash and done so i have my handy bucket and filled up with some i should have went with water water for sure it'll be warm water It gets hot again, remember, my hot water is not real hot. But we're going to go with this, and I'm going to splash the one panel in the tub surround glass with 
with hot water. And that's without wiping it or anything, we'll see what it looks like. Once again, I'm sorry you can't see a lot of it because, well, because I don't have a stand for my phone. That is amazing. I don't know if you can see what I can see. It's just totally clear. It's clear, 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 except for the water drops. So I'm going to get more water and I'm just going to hose off the ends. It even went to this one. And it's taken everything right off and making it crystal clear. This is truly amazing. It's all natural. I'm going to throw water around in the whole shower. It's just unbelievable. The soap scum came right off the slate also. It smells great in here. So I hope you enjoyed the video. What I would do probably is like um, eight thieves, 10 lemon. Lemon really helps to make it streak free. So I would say a little bit more lemon. You don't have to use that much water. You can mix it. You can make it stronger or lighter depending. This was pretty dirty and it's pretty nice. So I'm gonna finish the entire glass and slate. And if you're interested in buying thieves, by Young Living, it's their blend. Just go below to my link and you can get it at wholesale pricing and I can help you and we can work on recipes. Thank you. If you also want more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel, give me a thumbs up, even subscribe to my Facebook page. If you want to make an extra income, you can make it with this too. You can sell it to other people. If you're buying it already, if you're spending $100, $200 on cleaning, um, bath and beauty products, then why not spend your $100 or $200 on this per month and get rewards back and get some free products. And if you get people underneath you to sign up, soon you'll be making money. And we all work together as a team. Thank you.